One of the things I've learned in the past few weeks is just how many things can make my throat hurt. There's acid reflux, canker sores, postnasal drip that makes me think I have strep, but then there's that other one that I can't stop thinking about that makes me take my temperature every time I feel sweaty. I don't know how long this is going to last, and I don't know exactly how my life's going to look for the next year, or whether school is going to be online in the fall. I don't do well with cloudiness, with living in the present and not thinking about the future. Maybe that's why I've started paying attention to my senses more recently, something I can definitely know of for sure. Because of my coronavirus anxiety, I've been testing my sense of smell a lot more than usual. There are a lot of lovely flowers outside, but I often end up lifting my shirt collar and smelling myself. Usually I smell pretty good, kind of soapy or a little like what I just ate. I've also taken to sniffing the pillow when I first wake up, and I never thought I'd say this, I'm thankful for having a sweaty head. I really like eating Oreos in the way that's considered boring and unimaginative, not twisting them apart, just biting down on the whole sandwich. I love the contrasting textures, feeling the ridges on the two cookies, closing in with my front teeth, and then that satisfying snap when both cookies break at once and the cream kind of oozes out the sides, and I'll stop talking about Oreos now. I don't love the feeling of exercising on the stationary bike, but I do love the feeling of getting to slow down and stop when you're done. And I love the feeling of finally washing off all my sweat in the shower. I also love getting out of the shower all wet and cold and then throwing a towel over my head and suddenly somehow having my whole body feel warmer. This is a big one. I was super fascinated by Teo making a dodecahedron and I wanted to try making some solids of my own. So I printed out some guides and started folding and it was the most relaxed I've been since the lockdown started. I love folding paper, getting the creases just right, watching a solid form take shape. This week I got a shipment of origami paper and it's been really fun so far. I've learned how to make a pretty good butterfly. I really like putting on socks. I used to find socks kind of constricting, but now whenever it gets drafty in the house and my feet get cold, I love the feeling of putting on socks and then just not having cold feet anymore. It's like an easy answer in a crossword puzzle. You fill it in and then you just feel better for the rest of the day. Anyway, those are some of the sensory things that have brought me clarity in these cloudy times. What senses have you been noticing lately?